Hey everybody, Repeat of Handicapping, Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Racecourse, Grantville, Pennsylvania, on Friday evening, December the 16th, and this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this evening, folks, 8.29 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, 3 years old and up, race for a claiming prize of some $13,000. Tenders number 1, Comet Road. Number three, Catch a Penny K. Number two, Hickory Gray. And number seven, Girls Getaway. Number one, Comet Road qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Has won 16 times in her career to date, racing at tonight's distance of a mile on the dirt. She's turned in a trio of power run wins in her last five starts, including a more than five length power run win her last time out. Jockey William Otero and trainer Stephanie Beatty sent her to the post. They've hit the board with the 58% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number three, Catch a Penny K takes a class drop of 12 units, shares the speed honors in this field with my top pick. Recent past performance sheet show back to back power run wins in her third and fourth races back. Race seven summary number one, Comet Road tops my contenders list, which also includes number three, Catch a Penny K, number two, Hickory Gray, and number seven, Girls Getaway, one, three, two, seven, and the seventh from. And national. I have a couple of bonus long shots for you. Let's go to Charlestown first, race one. Number nine, XF Buckles. A five to one shot. Qualifies as a power pony. The overall speed leader in this maiden field, racing at or about tonight's distance of nine furlongs on the dirt. Hawthorne race course, race one, the five to one shot. Number five, Holy Classic drops in class by seven track master units is the overall speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt. So from Penn National on a Friday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.